Do you know you can use bullet points in six mark questions in science? So I'm going to show you how to write a perfect answer in bullet points to this question. So this question talks about some ice that's changing from a solid to a liquid and then increasing in temperature to five degrees. The question says explain the changes in arrangement and movement of the particles as the ice melts and the temperature increases to five degrees. So here are my particles in a solid. And now what we describe them is their pattern is regular. Whereas in a liquid, they have an irregular pattern or they don't have a pattern at all. Next, we're gonna talk about the movement of the particles. So in a solid, the particles aren't stationary, they are moving, um, but they're vibrating. They're vibrating about a fixed point. They go back and forth, up and down, left to right, um, but they don't actually go anywhere overall. Whereas particles in liquid do move past each other and they move freely. So let's use those kind of terms in our answer um, to be able to make sure we get six out of six marks. So particles in a solid are in a regular pattern and they vibrate about a fixed position. So those are the phrases you've got to use um, to get marks in this question. Let's talk about liquids. Um, so next, move the line down. Particles in a liquid are in a, an irregular or random arrangement and particles. So next is the final thing. Now that will probably get you up to about three or four marks. We've then got to talk about what happens when the temperature increases to five degrees. So as it's five degrees, it's no longer a solid. We're only talking about the state of being a liquid. So how do we describe what's going on here? So you can say as the liquid increases in temperature and the particles move faster, they do not vibrate. They're not vibrating because they're a liquid. Uh, but they move faster, uh, you could say it has a, a higher kinetic energy. Now, the last point we could say here um, is, well, what's happening um, when the change of state is happening? So the idea is the particles don't actually move more, they just break apart. So you could say when um, it's melting particles, um, you could say um, do not move faster, so do not uh, increase kinetic energy, um, but you could say they move further apart, so their potential energy um, increases. So I've marked a bunch of these answers in the past, and please make sure you're reading the question carefully. Don't get two out of six like a lot of students do, because they don't aren't specific enough for, uh, with their answer.